Adventures in Pixie Land presents your daily energy reading. Today's astrological forecast for June 11th, 2023 is, well, quite a doozy. First, you have a void, of course, moon at 920 a.m. EDT. Then you have a waning crescent moody moon in dynamic Aries. In the morning, disruptive Pluto enters strict Capricorn. It's retrograde in Capricorn. Messenger Mercury in steadfast Taurus is trying disruptive Pluto in strict Capricorn. And then messenger Mercury enters into quick-footed Gemini. So Pluto in Capricorn is about finishing up something that relates to your goals, responsibilities, or life direction. The trine with Mercury means that research and uh, solutions are highly favored on this day. Now, there's a whole other slide because it's a complicated day. So then we have relationship-focused Venus in dynamic Leo, square, expansive Jupiter in sensual Taurus. So Venus square Jupiter says lazy energy is at play. But the moon in Aries brings, you know, fresh energy. And the Mercury going into Gemini will bring new ideas. Today's Elder Futhark Daily Rune for June 11th, 2023 is... Tewaz. Tewaz. The letter T, meaning T, the sky god. Associations, leadership, warrior, balance, self sacrifice, logical thought, rationality, victory. Today, your focus is on finding the balance from within to ensure that you maintain the rational portions of your mind versus all that warrior energy you have in abundance. Today's Daily Romance Angel Oracle card for June 11th, 2023 is Deception. Deception. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. This card is a loving nudge for you to beware of deception within your relationship. This could involve something mild, such as run-of-the-mill politeness, where your partner is afraid of offending you by sharing true feelings. Perhaps you're the one wearing the mask because you aren't disclosing something to your partner. Deep down, you know what this card pertains to. The romance angels are trying to protect your heart. Please say this invocation either silently or aloud. Romance angels, I ask that you give me clear guidance that I can easily notice and understand to reveal the truth about this situation to my conscious awareness. Then notice and trust the signs that follow. This card is also a reminder to you about the importance of being genuine with your partner. Although discussing your true feelings may be uncomfortable, it will improve your relationship on many levels. Today's Daily Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for June 11th, 2023 is Chakra Fairy. Card 53, Chakra Fairy, Alignment. Spin the top today. Chakras are the whirling spheres of energy that hold our astral and etheric bodies within our physical bodies. They channel the energy received from the universe and put it into a form that is usable within the human body. These spheres regulate and balance all the energies that vibrate through us. All is well as long as these fields of energy are in alignment. However, if they become bogged down or spin at the wrong vibration, issues can arise. Problems can include ill health, low energy, depression, mental or emotional conditions. It's a good idea to do a chakra exercise daily. This need not take a long time to do. If you are pinched for time, ask your elemental helpers to balance your chakras for you. They will be glad to do so. One easy method for balancing chakras is through visualization. Sit in a chair or recline on the bed. You may light a candle or play soft music. Just be comfortable and warm enough to be able to relax thoroughly. Now, begin by breathing regularly. 
start with nice deep breaths and after a few breaths move down into a steady breathing just as you would when you go to bed at night visualize before you a clear beautiful red mist now breathe this mist way down deep into your body exhale any negative energies or worries that may have been bothering you breathe in this red mist into your body for several breaths until it feels like you are done next see an orange mist before you and begin to breathe in this clear bright orange mist continue with this for yellow and then green then blue next indigo and violet I like to finish by visualizing a clear white light this is like the finishing touch that strengthened the connection to spirit your chant I recognize the patterns of energy that flow through and about my body these energies are in perfect divine balance my health is radiant my mind is clear I am in harmony I give thanks to spirit so be it your daily starseed oracle card for June 11 2023 is the cosmic heart the cosmic heart devotion potency make your life a moving prayer when you surrender to the state of devotion you find yourself flowing with all of life you're being called to refocus your attention deep within to the intelligence of your own heart to bow with deep reverence to your inner temple to live your life in devotion to this place to make your life one big moving prayer perhaps you felt a bit off kilter lately sensing that the potency of why you're doing things has gotten a little watered down or weak perhaps you've forgotten what made you start doing them in the first place if so this is your call to take a moment and reconnect with the truth at the very center of your heart to get back the essence of what you're about to devote your life to what you care most about to turn your gaze deep 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 there are seasons for harvesting and seasons for sowing right now you're being called to plant your soul seed and to sing to them with deep devotion to feed them with the sweetest waters of your own soul to lose yourself in the potency of what it is that most expands your heart to live your life according to what makes you come alive rather than what everyone else thinks to make your life one big moving prayer your star seed soul inquiry how can you make your life a moving prayer your daily priestess of light oracle card for june 11th 2023 is shamanic journey card 23 shamanic journey purpose attunement vision quest this radiant shamanic priestess rides the wind horse before the full moon heralding a sacred time for you one that can lead you into great personal healing and radical transformation a literal or metaphysical journey awaits you unearthing such profound wisdom your life may never be the same if you wonder what your true purpose is now is the time to open up and receive the white feathers of the priestess's headdress are a symbol of spirit a message about freedom from the mundane world the pursuit of spiritual matters may be where your greater purpose lies and the expression of your spirit's value and power may come in the form of shamanic practices like healing ceremony and psychic vision let yourself look first to this side of you for it could reveal the core purpose from which all other intentions and activities grow the 
antler in the priestess's left hand is a symbol of higher connection. Since a young deer regularly sheds its antlers, the message here is for you to take some time to learn what old perceptions need to be shed for your own growth and higher purpose. Attune to the voice of your higher self and don't be afraid to let go. For the promise of new opportunities and expanded perception is clear. These new approaches will illuminate your passion, passage, and vision quest. You deserve to devote yourself to your soul's evolution. Meditate on your purpose and envision the inner and outer journeys that will bring you greater attunement. Once you prioritize this process, your purpose will be fulfilled in magical and even miraculous ways. Your affirmation, I am attuned to the shaman within. I devote myself to my own soul's journey and I am blessed. Today's daily energy reading for June 11, 2023 is uh, the astrology is pretty heavy. Karma is in play with that Pluto retrograde. New ideas and fresh energy can come into play when trying to be, bring resolutions to old situations. If there has been anyone throwing up blocks in the past, it's about to be settled out. Tewaz asks you to use your rational mind first. The Romance Oracle warns you against potential deception. The fairies ask you to balance your chakras today. The Starseed Oracle asks you to plant the seed that is your divine mission deep into your soul so it can grow. The Priestess of Light Oracle asks you to be open and pay attention to your inner shaman and open up to change. This is all really happening because of the astrology being so heavy. With this all these changes coming about and potentials for the past to come into the present, all of these warnings are very true. Someone may approach you uh, uh, prefacing an apology, but there's a good chance that that apology, apology is a deception. So keep your chakras balanced. Use your rational mind. Don't emotionally react. Keep in mind what you want to have big picture long term for yourself as far as any situation or relationship goes. And then listen to your inner self when interacting with others today.